my banana in this song is my life. <laughs> um, hi guys. So, oh, oh, oh. a little bit, I'm coming off like this high of working like for the past two hours. Like, I don't know. Okay, I do. I had coffee this morning. And when I have coffee, those two hours during coffee intake and after, I'm like, I'm just killing it. I was, I'm so proud of myself right now. I, how, how do I even start? This was a lot happening at once. Well, hi. <laughs> I don't know why I can't talk all of a sudden. So this morning, okay, what's today? It's Monday, happy Monday. September 12th, 11th, I don't know. It's a day of the week. But last week, TMI, I had my period and I was literally the meanest person, like not to people, but more so like to myself. And I was just like, I was productive and I got my stuff together, but I was just so like, ugh, because since starting school again, and like being in full-time school, um, I have been, it has been so hard to get on a routine. But guys, I think this morning and like this past weekend, I just like got myself like in that headspace. Like, I don't know what it was, but I have allergies. I feel like I'm back to being in the game. So I thought I would do a little car vlog going to school right now. Um, so, this morning I had my, my groceries shipped, S-H-I-P-T. If you live in the Grand Rapids area or like Michigan area, um, I believe Meyer is the only company that's partnered with that in Michigan or Grand Rapids. I will have my code down below. If you use it, you get $10 and I get $10 off, which is a really cool deal. It's like free money and you should use that code because it is such a cool service and you sim it's just like Postmates essentially, but it's for groceries. And you, like last night I made my grocery list and I submitted it to be like picked up by a shipped worker. And I had a delivery this morning at like 8.30 in the morning and I was just, you know, I had my groceries. It saves me like two hours of like going to the store, coming back and all that. It's just a really good service. I really love it. And at first I was kind of like skeptical about it, but now like I can't stop using it and I love it. Um, it just like saves me time. And if you are a busy person like myself, going to school full time, you work full time, my job is YouTube full time and it is very much so a busy job. It's like the hardest job, it's like one of the, it's like no way like it is the hardest job I've ever had ever. And I've worked at like every possible situation like restaurant, amusement park, um, retail, babysitting, like everything, I've done it. And this is the hardest job ever, but I, but it's also like the most rewarding and at, at times, it doesn't always compete to the same level of like reward. Like if I work for a, on a video for like 20 hours and I post it and it doesn't like, it doesn't like do well, which is the reality of YouTube, sometimes things don't do well. Um, your work doesn't always like compute or doesn't always uh, match. Anyways, that was not part of my rant plan or just, not, I'm not ranting, I'm just talking. I look so pale right now. Um, wait, thumbnail could be like, um, I, I don't know, I can't talk, okay. Um, so, I'm currently eating freeze dried bananas from Trader Joe's. They're in a little baggie because it's like a lot less messy. I have my lunch in the bag or like dinner. I eat dinner at like four-ish with, with classes and stuff. I have a test tonight. I'm not gonna say anything about it. I'm gonna just put good intentions out there because I am going to do my best and it's all I can do. And I, it's so hard to say that because I'm very much like hard on myself, but okay. I'm dropping that topic or I'm not gonna dwell on it. Um, <laughs> I'm in a weird mood right now. I don't know what's wrong with me. I just feel so like empowered. I don't know. Um, I, I'm i doing a like a branded video with a company called We Heart It, and it was approved this past weekend, and I just got it like the thumbnail, and like I got it all like pre-uploaded and like tagged and all that stuff this morning. 
And then I also got another video privated and uploaded that I'm posting, I think today. I also don't want to like pull my focus from studying because I have a gap to study between classes before my test. So I might just post that on Tuesday. I'll see how I'm feeling about my test when I in through that time. All I have to do is press public, but I know I'm gonna want to like post it on different like social media, or reply to comments. Like I wanted to see how I'm feeling. But that video is um, Halloween DIYs and life hacks, and I'm so proud of myself that it's so early. I know it's literally September like the 10th, but like honestly. You're gonna see those videos in your sub boxes like in a week or so. So like whatever. And plus I just wanted to and it's my channel. So like don't get mad at me. It's fun. I just have it's literally Halloween. Like, you know, it's fun. Um then uh, I don't know man. I was just like this morning I was like boom. Oh and I also was on Amazon and I ordered some more stuff for like a squishy video. I'm gonna do a second review of those. They're really fun to do. I really enjoyed that last time. My legs like itching. Um, and yeah, and I also ordered um, some more glue for a glue test video. That's really fun to film last time. And I have, I'm comparing two glues that are like, not like Elmer's, like the name, like the brands that like everyone uses. Um, so they're very like, random but I'm pumped to do it. I think it's really fun and really enjoy the film. Um and yeah so this week is freaking crazy but I'm just taking it day by day. I'm in a good spot right now. I'm really tired. I'm gonna crash I think middle of the day because I'm so exhausted from working so much. Like I'm I'm really proud of myself and I'm really like excited for what's like coming and just like my channel and stuff. I'm excited but I'm also a little bit drained but shoot girl like get some water and some coffee and you know like you'll be good so this guy is not is it blinkering oh my god oh i'm so stupid oh okay um so tomorrow what's i gonna say so tomorrow i have a class and then i'm modeling for i'm I, I hate saying I'm modeling, but like I am for a company called Down to Earth in Grand Haven, um, Michigan. And that's gonna be at like 11 a.m. And then when I get back, I need to film. I need to film. Um, I'm gonna be filming a reacting to your musicallys. So if you want to, comment down below your username for musically and I'll read that too but there was literally like 7,000 comments on my video where I asked for that so I'm sure I'm okay with names but like if you want, I'll read the comments I will read the comments this one as well I'm also filming a video I will not say yet because it's really super secretive but I'm pumped for it um, and uh, then I have a night class on Tuesday and I'm doing so like I'm majoring in like um, multimedia journalism so essentially it's like literally whatever you would think that means and like like broadcasting and reporting and all of that kind of thing so I'm reporting on this event and it's, it's gonna be downtown in Grand Rapids and I'm going to do like I have to leave at my six my like nighttime class thing um, and then I have to go to this event thing which I'm so pumped for I'm a little bit nervous as it's like my first event of the semester so I'm always like I forgot how to do this but I just, I know I haven't done it in a while but I know how to so yeah that's tomorrow and then Wednesday I have class all day and then Thursday I have to get up go to the dog borders drop off my puppies um go to class drop off an assignment leave early um, and then go to the airport and I'm going to New York, which I'm pumped about. Um, I'm collabing with someone that you guys are gonna know. You're gonna be like, what? Like, you'll be, it's cool. This person's not on YouTube, really. Like, the, the person is, but they're not like on YouTube. Um, they are like on Instagram and you, if I said it, you'd be like, oh my God, I know who that is. So yeah, um, I'll be vlogging that for sure. And then I'm doing like some, I think I have two meetings, I think, that are gonna be there, so that'll be fun. I'm doing, I'm doing a little photo shoot. Um, so I'll be there Thursday afternoon, 
Friday and then I'll leave Saturday morning at like 6 a.m. I come back to Michigan, get my pups, and go to my brother's birthday party on Saturday, which leaves Sunday to study all day for my exam in a week from now. So that's my life. I'm sorry I'm rambling today. I just have a lot to say apparently. But that's my life. So if you don't see me as frequently on this channel for the next week, that's why. But I'm going to be vlogging. But I definitely just like don't think I'll be able to post like a lot. But I'm sure I might surprise you and be like, surprise, new vlog. So I'm gonna be vlogging. This is fun to vlog. And I have a crazy week ahead of me, but really fun. I have a lot of work to get done before I leave for New York, but also once I'm there, I'm gonna have downtime, I think for sure, on like Friday early morning, probably just then. Yeah, and then Saturday evening when I get back. So it's really well timed. I'm excited for this. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a good week. I'm gonna just take it day by day and focus on one thing at a time. But yeah, I'm gonna drive to class now and I will vlog after class is done. My neck hurts really bad. I need to like relax for a second. I can't, I'm like high strung right now, I can think. But I will talk to you guys when I'm after done with, I love words. After class is done and yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm back home. guys to realize that I'm almost done with class for the day but realize that I had to force myself into vlogging this because I'm so exhausted. I was at school for like nine hours and I'm so tired. Like honey. <laughs> and this morning I had my like productivity thing where I was like just getting things done. I look so tired and all I want is to go to, is to go home and have food, just be ready because I'm starving. But like, it's just me. So like Scooby and Thor can't really cook that well. <gasps> look at the sun. Um, it's so pretty. Oh, I, I'm focused too, great. Um, my eyes are watering because I'm that exhausted. Um, oh. Even talking is like, oh, okay, <laughs> me too, <laughs> love it. <laughs> um, I had that little like quiz and I really am like hyping up these little like quiz test things because, and I'll talk about it when the semester is done, but like this class is so hard for me. Um, like I'm just like, it's, you'll understand why when I can say more, okay, like, hello, I'm uh, right here, thank you. I will say more when the semester is done. Um, I just don't want anyone to like watch this or like, I don't know, I just feel dumb. Not really, but like, I just don't want people to be like, oh, it's not class. Like, who knows, who knows? But yeah, I don't know how I got, it wasn't even that bad because um, like I was ready for like, you know, reciting some difficult, some more difficult things and it wasn't like that it was like very simple actually but thank god because i need god to just at anyone god the universe all the friggin above to work in my favor to get me through graduation i am when i say that i'm determined to graduate in four years i mean that i'm like i wake up and i'm like today i'm doing this crap of stress and non-stop because I'm graduating in four years. <laughs> and if you think I'm lying to you, giving you like a little like BS, like pep talk, honey, this is what I tell myself every day to get through. And because it is hard to do full-time school in like general by itself. When you tack on like doing YouTube full-time, having your own like shop for like your Etsy shop and then also trying to like travel and like the thing about YouTube is like it never really stops and I'm the kind of person that like I truly never stop with YouTube like if and please don't take that as like I'm going to overwork myself because honestly um 
I like, I love it and I never like feel, there's times where I feel overworked because of trying to balance everything and do it all. And if you're like, Nicole, then why are you getting your degree if you're complaining about YouTube? Honey, I think this is like my own personal thing. Like I respect everyone's decision, but for me, um, if you guys, like I completely am just working, like my main income is YouTube. I have, there's no like issue there. That's the thing. But like, I just would feel more secure with a degree. Plus, when I went to college three years ago, four years ago in a year, three years ago, I didn't know what I wanted to do. I literally thought I wanted to be like a fashion designer, like, what like you know so I think that college also helps you figure out like who you are how to be independent you learn so many skills in college and I meet people and this is if you're my friend and we're watching this like you're my friend and it's people that I'm not friends with really and I really just not I'm not around much that like they're just like they lack like people skills and communication skills and just like general knowledgeable things and also just taking a step back I'm aware the only like I know you can be knowledgeable and educated and without going to college but like it's a really big question I always get um, with like people at school more so and I'm always just like it's just it's just like, kind of the same exact thing I, I always kind of like allude it to um, People that just worked in, like this is like back then, I'm talking like back then, like on the farm kind of thing, where they just did high school they were, and they were on the farm, but there was like a transition phase um, years ago where like my grandparents, like that kind of thing, that kind of era, I, I'm trying, I'm not, I sound rude. Um, that generation, um, they went to, um, high school, got their diplomas, and then they just worked in a factory. And that's a thing. That is for sure a thing. But then the thing happened where tons of factories cut people. They just cut them and they were gone. And there, I, it's not a perfect example because now, like, people on YouTube can do things with, like, acting or there's different, there's different, like, revenue streams that aren't just YouTube AdSense. And I totally understand that. Um, I don't know, that's something important to me about having a degree. And I also really, like, you can't get, like, yes, I have experience with YouTube and all of that as, like, a resume builder. But having a degree, I, it just, it shows a future employer you were literally trained and skilled for this certain thing that makes you a better applicant and that's not to sound cocky it's just like the literal truth my friend Adrian and I talked about this and it was like my sophomore year spring break I think no yeah it was 2016 like when I first met her in May we we're talking about this and I was like dude that's so I think that she had brought it up how for a job she applied for she told how she became more valuable because she had her degree and once again, and if I don't repeat this, I'm gonna get attacked. Maybe not, I don't know. I'm just over displaying because you have to sometimes to protect yourself on the internet. But yeah, I don't know. I really like, it's hard because when I'm done with school, literally in April of 2018, which is gonna come so fast and I'm just pumped for it, which I got, that's gonna graduate. Um, I don't know if I wanna, it's hard because I would like to be free for like a few months, half a year and be able to travel. And I'm sure I'll do a thing where like until a certain point, like for like six months or so, I'll just like leave it open to like figure out the next step because I'm very grateful and so blessed. And if I don't ever say that enough, trust me, I tell everyone how much I love what I do and like, if I don't say it, I try and like act it because I'm so grateful I don't even like, I try not to think about it too much because I just like, I don't know. I'm rambling, holy crap. Um, 
I can't talk. Um, what was I saying? Oh, I'm so grateful that I can have time after I graduate to be like, okay, what's the next step? While still making an income off YouTube and living the, like the coolest dream of like ever, like living, I don't, it's just, it's so crazy. Um, but what I was kind of like getting around to was, do I want to get like an internship or I don't want to use my degree right away. But what I do want to do, I do want to do, I love English. Um, I want to keep myself routined and even when, like I'm my most productive when I'm in school full time, traveling, doing YouTube full time, trying to vlog, like, cause I'm routined, you know? Like it's the same thing for like high school sports for me was when I was in season for a sport, I was like, I was on my stuff because I literally had to be. When you're when you have a lot of free time, like you don't take advantage of it, you can't manage your time well. And that's not, not to say that if you just do YouTube, that's bad. That's amazing, good for you. But I'm the kind of person that not only does better when I'm routined and like I have to film this day and this day and this day, um, but I also just want to like I, I want to get out there and I want to work for different companies and I want to intern at different like places that I've dreamed of and like I really like I really want to like like one of I want to work for like like Google or like like Twitter or Facebook or Instagram like I want to work for a bigger name company and I I just have a hard time when someone says like do you want to do acting or something and I'm like yes but like I don't know if that's like the thing for me but the thing is, I haven't had like a time to figure out the thing for me, which is what I want to do with that time when I'm done with college, is to figure out if I want to go into acting, if I want to do a real, like a real, like, like degree job. Um, and like after this hurricane came through, I realized, like I really realized how much I'm obsessed with like storm tracking and like my whole life I have if you ask anyone in my close family, if there is like a small chance of a thunderstorm, I am like eyes peeled, I'm on the weather all day, like I love it. Um, but yeah, I I love that kind of like news reporting, which is what my degree is essentially, but it's also like anything from like BuzzFeed-esque. Like we don't learn about how to report from BuzzFeed, but it's like, you learn skills that could help you to report at BuzzFeed or something. But they're kind of like reporting that I like to do. I love, and like reporting, I hate, it sounds funny because for me reporting is like hard news, which is, you know, like your everyday news channel, but I love BuzzFeed. I would love to, I don't want to work there right away or like in the next few years because you, can't have your own personal channel, I believe. I read that somewhere, or like, no, I watched that in one of like the Why I Left BuzzFeed videos. But I don't think you have to abandon your YouTube channel if you're like an intern, and I don't know. I wanna just get my foot in the door somewhere and like in the actual professional world. Um, I don't know. I interned at a radio station in Grand Rapids last fall, and I loved it. Like, it's just doing things that aren't just YouTube that aren't just YouTube sometimes really like inspires me and it helps me this I did not plan on ranting I keep saying ranting talk venting venting discussing remember how I was like I'm so tired now I'm like blah, 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 life in 10 years blah, blah. I don't know it's getting darker I'm sorry I yeah so why don't I just I don't know what I'm saying all of a sudden Yeah, I just really want to professionally work in somewhere like, I don't know. I want to do things with my degree slash my experience with YouTube, like all of that combined to something else. I don't know what I want to like long term do, but like let me know if anyone does because I don't think people like actually know. I have an idea, but I don't like know, you know, until I like actually have time to like think about it because bro that was unnecessary you did not have to go 80 miles per hour around me as I'm merging onto the highway like sorry I can't drive that fast on a curb <laughs> no 
lights breaking. <laughs> See? Sorry, I'm not petty. <laughs> Me? But, yeah. Rant kind of over, bent over, I don't know. But, it's worth it. And, like, I love my classes except for this one class I'm in. I mean, it's like fine, but I just don't like, it's not my degree, so I don't love it. Which is a good thing that I don't love a non-degree class, you know, because that's not my degree. So, yeah. Also, I realized that my graduation date is like, uh, it's, so Playlist Live Orlando is like the last weekend in April, which is great, but I could either graduate that Friday or that Saturday, and I'm going to play this live regardless. Even if I have to literally graduate at 3 p.m. and get on a flight at 6 p.m., I'm going to be in Play This Live Orlando. Like, all my friends go in, but the thing is, like, my last name was, is, like, generally in the second half of the alphabet. If it's, if that's how it's ordered, I don't know. Um, but we'll see. Love you guys so much. Literally, I love you guys forever. I'm turning this camera off and I'm going to 